Hey there, Blake here from the Belly Be Gone Challenge. Today, I want to go over a few exercises that will help you uh, strengthen and shape and tone the backs of your upper arms. These are called triceps. Now, sometimes when, as we get a little older, we find that uh, certain parts of our body will start uh, to form, um, you know, this loose skin and some of the fat will kind of just hang down a bit, especially in these areas here. So what I want to show you today is a uh, two exercises that will help shape, tone, and firm up that entire area. Now, the good thing about these, this method and these two exercises is they're not overly difficult to perform, okay? As long as you're consistent performing these exercises over the next 30 days, you're going to notice a big difference in the development of this part of your arm. So what we're going to try to do here is we are going to get rid of those bat wings, <laughs> All right. affectionately called bat wings. So uh, there are going to be two exercises that I want you to perform. It's not going to take you any more than five minutes. As soon as you roll out of bed, I want you to perform these two exercises, okay? The first exercise is going to be the close grip wall push-up. Now, we're going to put a kind of a different spin on this we're going to do what are called 21s. So we're going to do, uh, this exercise is going to be divided into three portions. The top portion, which will go down to the halfway portion, the bottom portion to the halfway portion, and then from the top to the bottom in a full range motion. So what we're going to do is we're going to do seven reps. Seven, I'm going to show you right now, we're going to do a close grip wall push up. Now I want your hands to be close together and what we're going to do is we're going to do seven repetitions from the top to the midway point of this exercise. So we're going to go halfway, one, squeeze at the top, halfway, two, squeeze at the top, halfway, three, squeeze at the top. You really want to squeeze the back of your arms. Halfway, squeeze at the top, halfway, squeeze at the top, halfway, Squeeze at the top, halfway, and these, this is your seventh repetition, and really squeeze the back of your upper arms. That's, that's the first part of this movement. The second part is going to be, we're going to slowly descend all the way down, and we're going to push with our back of our upper arms to the halfway point. We're gonna hold, and then back down. Hold, back down. We're gonna do that seven times, hold, and you really want to squeeze the back of your upper arms while you're doing this. Squeeze, squeeze, descend, squeeze, descend, squeeze, descend. And you're really going to start to feel a little bit of a burn in the back of your upper arms. And that's exactly what we want to do. So you do seven repetitions like that. And then you go all the way to the top, squeeze the back of your upper arms. And we're going to do full, seven full repetitions. So... One, squeeze. Two, squeeze. Three, squeeze. Four, squeeze. Now I'm really starting to feel it in the back of my upper arms. Five. Six. And hold. Slowly go up and squeeze. Woo! You really feel it in the back of my upper arms. So, the next, as soon as you're done this exercise, I want you to perform the second exercise. We're going to do the tricep kickback, but we're going to put a little spin on it. Now, you're going to be using probably the two and a half or five pound dumbbells. Put them in each hand. I don't want you to bend at the waist. What we're going to do is we're going to, with both arms, is we're going to kick back all the way and we're going to perform one tricep kickback hold and with the other arm we're going to do another tricep kickback hold hold squeeze perform with the other arm hold and squeeze and you're going to do that eight repetitions for each arm and you're really going to feel it in the back of your upper arms because we're holding that contraction position for our triceps or the back of our upper arms. 
and you're going to perform eight repetitions or 16 repetitions in total. Woo! I can really feel it in the back of my upper arms. And that's exactly what we want to do. We want to make sure that we get full contraction in the backs of our upper arms, our triceps. So when we do that, we hold uh, the types of method that we're using with the 21s and the tricep kickbacks, we're making sure that we get as much blood flowing in this area as possible. The end result is you're going to notice over the next 30 days, more shapely, more defined, and more, more strength in that area of your arms. All right, everyone, I hope you enjoyed this. Remember, if you know someone who could use this video, please share it with your network or like and comment below. All right, remember, stay safe, stay strong, never give up. All right, talk to you later.